Hello children, welcome to our new session. Today, we will take a quick review what you have learned in previous class. All of you have already learned numbers and number names up to 100. So let's have some fun with this worksheet. First question is numbers and words. And the next question is numbers and digits. Students, please do it in your home. Next topic is forward and backward counting. When we count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, we go in forward direction where every number is one more than other number. But when we count in the reverse direction, 10, 9, 8, 7, we are going backward. Hence, it is called backward counting. Using number line, it is very easy to understand after, before and between. As we know, after number 1, number 2 comes. What comes next? Number 3. Something comes next or behind is after number. But if I ask which number comes earlier or before number 3? That is number 2. Before 2, number 1 comes. Now, number 2 comes after 1 but before 3. That means number 2 is between number 1 and number 3. Students, let's do some question to understand these topics. Our next topic is ascending and descending order. As we know, ascending order means smallest to greatest. In our first question, which is the smallest number? Yes, you are right. 15 is the smallest number. Then comes 36. After then, 61. After 61, 74 comes. And which one is the greatest number? Yes, you are right. 92. In this way, we can do the rest of the questions. Building order means greatest to smallest. Now, in this series of questions, in the first one, which number is the greatest number? Yes, 75. After 75, 61 comes. Then, 37. After 37, 28. And which is the least number? 11. Now, students, do rest of the questions. Next topic is expanded and short form. For example, 24 can be written in expanded form as 2 tenths and 4 ones. 3 tenths and 2 ones makes 32. This is called short form. We can practice this at home with the question provided in your book. Our next topic is addition. Addition means to put things together. We can take help of fingers or making dots or lines. The first question 6 plus 4 is 10. Students, do the rest of the questions to enhance your knowledge. Our last topic of this lesson is subtraction. It means to take away. In the first question, 9 minus 3. Answer is 6. Students, I have given some question to practice. I hope you will solve these problems.
with the help of this video complete your first lesson i hope you have enjoyed today's session see you next time bye